Wake it up, wake it up, boy. You already know it's diesel talk. Hey, man, drink your water. Drink your H2O. It already the end of the summer, and you probably think about think about how much water you probably done drunk this whole summer. You probably ain't, man. Come on, whole body stinking like urine. You feel me, boy? Hey, y'all, man. Listen, we diving off into this right now. We diving off in all in some of the backlash. You feel me about Crip Max Sendison? You know what I'm saying? Cause whack, whack, whack in his boy. You know what I'm saying? Whacking his boy that did, I think, 20 years or something. He had a dude on Clubhouse. They was talking, and he was breaking it down, and, and they came to the conclusion that Crip Mac is snitching for getting 33 months. Listen, man. I'm a, I'm a dumb move, and listen. Let me tell y'all something. I am at the point in my life, you feel me, that I don't just favor with my homies. You know what I'm saying? I don't just favor with this click or that click or this gang and this. No, what's right and right and what's wrong is wrong. You feel what I'm saying? That's just how it works. You know, and 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 and, and. I like Crit Max whole 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 style. I like the style he brings to the internet. I like the entertainment. You feel what I'm saying? And uh, he's definitely one of the kind. And, and and there's nobody that's gonna be replaced him. He's who he is. You know what I'm saying? And, yeah, we definitely need him back. And that's the thing about him snitching though. I'm talking from experience. I don't know where everybody else is talking from. I'm talking from personal experience. I did 10 years in the feds. Nine years, 10 months to be exact. From 2006 to 2015. And I'm telling y'all like this. When I first went in the feds in 2006, you, 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 you was getting five years for a strap. I got five for the five. I said, I got five for the, for the, I got five for the crack, five for the gun. You feel what I'm saying? Straight like that. It wasn't no if, ands, and buts. I took a, 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 I had a 924C. A 924C in the feds is, 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 is where they saying the, the gun is protecting the dope. Or the good, yeah, the gun is protecting the drugs. You feel what I'm saying? So it's like in him, right? So, People want people want the 922G. The 922G, y'all, is just a simple possession. Now, them dudes was like getting a little bit up under five years. You know what I'm saying? So, like right around a three, right? They was getting three with the 922G, if I'm not mistaken. Y'all let me know in the comments, man. If any of y'all been to the feds or got some people, man, that been to the feds, let me know, man, when they, you know, for a gun charge, what time did they receive? I got the five, though. And everybody I know was getting the five or the three. With the 922G, just simple possession of a strap. You feel what I'm saying? Now, this is where the thing gets tricky, though, in the feds, right? If you have two of the same charges, drug or firearm. Now, I'm, we're going to use firearms. This is a crit mass situation, right? If you have two prior firearm charges and you catch a third one, you are automatically an armed career criminal, which starts at 15 years. That's going to be your first deal. You don't take that, you're going to get a Buck Rogers date. That's just that. I don't care how you look at it. So they didn't charge him, obviously, because I think he has two prior burner cases. I believe so. And they didn't charge him with it. So I, I don't know the reason behind that. You know what I'm saying? I don't I don't know for sure if they really have to. But that's the way it was going when I was there. You know what I'm saying? So right now, what, what, what whacking them saying is about him being a snitch and whoever feels like that. No, nah, I'm going to tell you within 33 months. Hell no, nah, he don't got to be a snitch. Fuck no. Niggas getting that. When I was getting out in 2015... Dudes was going in that was getting the 24 months. And I don't believe some of these dudes, I don't believe they was telling. You know what I'm saying? I don't know what they was actually doing, but I'm just saying, you know what I'm saying? It's like anything else. It's like the going right with something. That's what I was hearing now. The dudes is getting for burner cases. Look at Mozzie. Mozzie had, didn't he have a state burner turned over to the feds? He ended up getting a year and a day. And he got prior burner cases. You know what I'm saying? Money don't save you in the feds. When they want you, they want you. And he got a year and a day. So why does C-Mac got to be telling if he doing, if he, if he doing 33 months? Nah, I, don't, I, don't, I, don't, I ain't feeling that. That's not the way, that's not the way it, it has to be. You feel what I'm saying? It, it's, see, now in the state, this is why the state gets tricky. The state is with full of a whole bunch from, from the senseless, 
I'm just saying from when you're in the county jail with the senseless ass always squabbling and and, and and things that could be avoided, right? That you just gotta go through because you in there. And then the state politics, whereas the feds, the feds is on a different type of a different type of structure, you feel me? But they gonna bust your ass though if you telling. That's one thing in the feds. You don't slip through the loopholes of telling. No, I'm gonna tell y'all right now, in the state, there's fools telling, getting back out. They not known snitches. The feds is going to put the jacket on you because the jacket's right. And that's what it is. When I was in the feds system for that, them whole 10 years, I seen some fools lurking. Ooh, I spilled that, y'all. I seen some fools lurking that I seen getting their shit bust later on because they done told. But it was only like one or two of them dudes that slipped through the cracks that I personally bumped into during my bid that slipped through them cracks. And end up getting their ass busted, getting their getting getting they head busted. You feel what I'm saying? It was only about two people that slipped through the cracks. And they end up getting done in. You don't slip through the cracks like that in the feds. Nope. They're going to be on you because people see in the state, you got these crazier murder, murderer Negroes where these dudes get up in the system and yeah, they want to come home, but it's it, it, from, the, from the outside. It, and from the outside looking in, sometimes it don't be seeming like it with the fed niggas. Nigga, they want to come home. Niggas got Buck Roger dates and niggas is trying to figure it out. You feel what I'm saying? So when you coming up in there, they not trying to hear that about what you got. How much time? for? Nah, it's something funny. Off the dribble, they're they going to be on you because niggas is stretched out. And they're not liking it. It's not a game to them. In the state, you know, I mean, yeah, I smoke wookie you know. In the feds, no, because they got life over getting some money. You see what I'm saying? They got life over getting some money. They trying to go home and get to it. So they going to be checking fools at the door. Is you hot or not? And Wack 100 was right about this. They got dudes on there. They got dudes in the system. You got homies that, yeah, we got we got paperwork, homies. That they That's all they do is check the paperwork. This is their main job because they know what to look for. You come in there, like, I'll be sometimes like, if we got the homies going to the hole or somebody, you know, the people to check the paperwork. If we on the, you know, on the west side or if you on the east side of the yard, you feel me? We got a homie on the east side of the yard that's going to be checking paperwork. We got a homie on the west side of the yard that's going to be checking paperwork. You know what I'm saying? So, and if one of them fools leave, I'm not going to never volunteer to be checking paperwork for the next week or two. And some fools is getting off the some fools getting off the chain with this much paperwork. With this much paperwork, they got this much paperwork. I'm not finna be laying up in wee hours of the of the night reading this somebody else's paperwork. To, and then guess what? If you lazy on the job and don't read it, you know what I'm saying? Don't read it, and, and you miss something. And you say he clear, and then somebody else got some something on him or know something, and you read that, oh, they politicking on you. You're going to get boobop. You feel me? You ain't going to get ran up, but you're going to get DP. You know what I'm saying? You Yeah, you're going to get DP. Mm-hmm. Probably not going to squabble up, though. They probably not. We ain't going to send no team of homies in on you or nothing. You probably do some burpees or something for that. You you know what I'm saying? Like, well, then, then again, it do probably, it, whatever happens, though, like, if you let somebody slip through the cracks, because fools have slipped through the cracks, and then double back and get on a nigga. You feel what I'm saying? And, and get on one of the homies or something like that. And get off so the homie could get hurt real bad. If he got hurt real bad, oh yeah, they're gonna up the they're gonna up the politics on you. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? It ain't gonna be no uh, DP with burpees. We burpees. You know what I'm saying? Uh, you looking like a fool on the yard doing burpees in the hot sun, nigga. You old burpees for doing some comedy shit. You just on the yard, nigga, up and down, up and down. Niggas is looking at you, and then you got somebody overseeing you counting them. Nah, I ain't never. Nah, that's why. I, that's why I never do things like that. That's why the homies ain't never DP me, and I, I honor myself on that. Cause why would you want your own homie socking you out? That's my homie socked me out. Uh, nah, it's, it's gonna be like. I ain't from the hood no more. I, I'm not going to go for that because I don't do things to put myself in the type of circumstances. And if you feel like I did, I feel like I didn't. So I'm not going to let nothing. Nah, that's a different. I'm at a different stage of my life. <laughs> nigga, fuck, I'll be ready to come back. Nigga, and kill everybody. Hey, hey, hey. <laughs>
<laughs> no, boy, wake it up, man. Y'all like and subscribe to the channel, man. Let me know how y'all feel in the comments, man. Know with this fool, C-Mac. You know what I'm saying? He ain't, nah, we can't put that jacket on him. You know, soon as he get out, cuz, he gonna be all waxed. You know what I'm saying? This internet stuff is getting crazy. But how we gonna end this, y'all? Um, we gonna say it like this. Listen. Don't care about who told. Don't care about, look, if you, no, nah, don't even care about nobody told. You did you do something they telling you? Cause that's what's gonna happen. We are in a day and time where you have to expect that. You feel me? And fools is pulling the card of it didn't. It didn't happen to. Yeah, I didn't know him. It didn't happen to me. Or woo 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 woo. And then everybody playing the hard role is not like that. It's not like that. You try to approach a whole bunch of snitching dudes or get up in that business and all that type of stuff, man, listen, man, people will bake you a cake. They'll be laying on you. That's why you don't even want to put that. I don't even like, if somebody's a snitch in this damn time, I just choose not to mess with them. I'm definitely not, I definitely don't got to worry about doing them to, 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 to somebody because I'm not going to be doing stupid shit with, 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 with another person. You feel what I'm saying? So I, I don't got to worry about that. Right? So if I hear this person, this dude over here, he told or he did this and that, I just stay away from him. You know what I'm saying? Because I don't want to deal with that baggage. And I suggest y'all to do the same thing. All the fools acting like King Kong, this and that. No, the fools is telling they will bust your ass in this damn time. I'm telling you, they will bust your ass in this damn time. So y'all take heed to that. Take heed to it. One day you might be somewhere by yourself. Ooh, that fool going to remember what you said to him, this and that. Come out the bushes on you and you don't know. You don't want to be watching your back like that. Just let them people be. Go catch up with your own crowd. That's what we used to tell them in the penitentiary. All right, catch up with your own crowd, homie. You didn't do over here. Go, go mess with them. Let me do right. Catch up with your own crowd. That's what you got to tell them. So, man, I, you know, free, free, free the Mac, man. Free C Mac. And we're going to leave it like that, man. Y'all let me know in the comments, man, how y'all feel about See you, Mac, man, and I'm going to, you know, get off this thing and uh, drop this whole video. And y'all let me know what y'all think. I'm gone. Boy!